Good evening, everybody. Welcome to no good evening, which in Polish is Dobry wieczór. It is 8:20. We just came back from Costco. I am not filming Costco haul this time because everything would unfreeze and I'm tired and we were running all over. So sorry about that. But next time I will. What I will do, I will take you for another adventure. You guys, you see this uh, little friend here, which lasted 12 years and just got broken. So I was baking. So first what happened with him, that is a uh, soup warming up for Kathleen. So first what happened, it start, it, it burned my bread. It, I, I set everything right and the bread got burned like in five minutes. It was actually not bread, it was baguettes. And I didn't know what, what happened. I was like, okay, did I do something wrong? Did I set the temperature wrong? And then I tried again. And what happened is uh, I put a thermometer inside and it wouldn't, so it would go to 180 uh, Celsius, which is 350 Fahrenheit. And it would beep, I would put the stuff in, but it would keep heating it up. So it came almost to like over 450 degrees and it was burning it. So what I started doing, like last time I baked, we baked the banana bread, which we just finished today, which was yesterday. And what was happening, I kept opening the door to bring the temperature down. But um, obviously that's not a safe way to do that. And then the, uh, the, the device, <laughs> the appliance, uh, started beeping and it said malfunction please unplug your device and then it, it just all went dark so bad news but good news i can choose myself a new one <laughs> uh, what can you do it's uh, it, it, it just goes over 10 years appliances when they are used a lot you can't expect more. I don't think so you can so anywho well we did dishwasher we did the microwave uh, right now right now the stove so we started looking for some we uh we went to lowe's we looked and then we went to costco today we looked there as well and i think i like hi lilush and i think i like so they are <laughs> you see you want to say yes yeah you you say hi okay i can i talk and then and then i feed you you think or you want a piece of chicken, but it's very spicy, poo poo. It's very spicy, okay? Uh, anyhow, coming back, she will probably interrupt me a little bit more. But with that being said, so I like Frigidaire, uh, but it's induction, which means I would need to change my pods. So I don't know if I like that. Um, and I don't use the stove top that much. I mostly cook in my uh, pressure cooker and air fryer. But the uh, oven has the air fryer option. And I looked at the YouTube at the, um, how it's called, uh, reviews. And they were saying it's very nice. Now, uh, when we went to Home Depot right now next to, um, next to uh, Costco, I uh, looked at Samsung, which is, has cool uh, option, Wi-Fi. You connect it to Alexa and then you connect it to your phone and you can see um you know when you warm up the oven when it's off to turn it off i think it's cool i don't know but it also has the air fryer so the fridge that it's 1500 the uh samsung which is with the wi-fi and the regular electric not not conduction the convection conduction you know guys what i'm talking about the top uh it's 1000 so it's 500 difference and i don't like i i know it's apparently better the conduction but because i would have to also change all my pots and it's already 1500 versus 1000 they both had air, air fryer they both look good so i think I'm, I'm i'm actually thinking about the about the samsung uh but we'll be going to pick pick it up tomorrow and i'll take you guys with me so we'll show you what we decide i'm going to sit down right now after i finish unpacking this mess uh, I will sit down and watch some YouTube videos about the Samsung. So I know that the, the fridge there is good. People were happy. The one thing they were not happy, it was because it has a touch screen. And uh, sometimes you have to really uh, push it strong to make it work. I thought it was cool thing because you wouldn't have to clean the knobs. But then again, I don't know. So uh, that's a, that's an adventure on our side. Tomorrow we'll go to have a look. I'm guessing uh, probably again to Lowe's and uh, Home Depot. I don't know. Or I will check online and then we'll go one place and then I'll show you which one we were considering and then which one we picked up. And, uh, and uh, yeah, because I can't bake anything right now. So for me, it's a problem because from the uh, stove, 
I don't use that much the top because as I said, I use a uh, air fryer and I use my uh, uh, my pressure cooker. The, the, even pasta today, I cooked in my pressure cooker because it's so much easier to clean and do everything. So rice, everything I do in my pressure cooker. But this little puppy, I use the oven. I bake pizza, I bake bread, I bake cinnamon buns, banana bread all the time. So right now we can't do that. We did banana bread yesterday and now we need to wait until we get a new one. So. So for me, the more important stuff is to have the good oven, not that much, whatever it's on top, because you know, to make scrambled eggs from time to time. Oh, that's what the, the Samsung had, what I liked. It had connected uh, heating devices too, so you could put a griddle. So really you could make uh, pancakes or eggs uh, more than just on one frying pan, which I think it's cool. So that was another thing which I like. Okay, and right now I'm going to go eat something, relax, and I will see you tomorrow, guys, when we go to pick up the stove. So this one is broken. Although I do not complain. This one, I looked also at Whirlpool, but the, the, they didn't have the air fryer option in the in the oven and it was so good reviews for the air frying option so you know i do use my air fryer which i still would but if i could like make a whole pack of pack of fries when i have a party in the big that would be awesome because in the little air fryer they get a little bit crampy it's not little i still have xl but still a pack of uh, fries doesn't fly you have to s s do it in two and then if i want to have chicken nuggets at the same time then you know so it would be awesome. Anywho, see you tomorrow, you guys. Now, let me relax a little bit. Good morning, everybody. No, not good morning anymore. Past 12. But hey, dzień dobry. <laughs> it is today Thursday, which in Polish is czwartek, and we are waiting for uh, Katalin to join us. Uh, we're going to go to Lowe's to try to pick up the stove, like I mentioned to you guys um, yesterday. So I kind of have, uh, will will show you if they still have it on the stand, but I think they should three which I considered. I kind of have my mind set up of one, but my uh, my uh, partner Baker is coming with me. Uh, so we'll have a look. We'll, we'll, uh, we'll let you know what we were considering and uh, why uh, we chose what I think we will choose, but we'll see. Anywho, two brands I looked at. It's uh, Samsung and Frigidaire. So we'll show you how they look like and we'll tell you why, what, and whatever. So you can see with us. Uh, we won't have the, the stove yet this, um, uh, uh, this vlog because it's going to be delivered next week. See you at Lowe's. So um, I'll show you first what what I'm not considering is gas. I'm afraid of gas. We have a connection. We could have it, and I know it's cheaper, but it's so easy to just have uh, something. Hold on a second. I hold on a second. So now, uh, this kind of Isabella is showing. Yes, I don't like because I have a wallpaper. So I do need that little back stuff for the and I don't Can like I the see? the knobs here either I'm so that's why those are out of question top, this top. yes this kind of top so we are left well, with one? the ones which have a back and let's have a look so I don't remember where they were so these are all no back no back oh I think here we have yeah does it have a back I just said it has to have a back we're not looking at anything so here is um, the raw, and this is the first one, which I want to show you guys. Okay, I'll flip around the camera. So this is the first one I was considering, but I decided not to have it. But okay, I'll here show. we go. So as you can see, it has the back, so I like it. It's very nice. What I like about it, no knobs to clean. Yeah. Although when I was watching the reviews, one of the guys said that it's actually hard to press sometimes. So I don't know, but Mama, the cleaning blue. part is cool. Blue. blue inside so this one is um, uh, induction 
So I don't know, for some people it's pro, for me it's con, I would have to change my pods and there are some pods I would not be able to find uh, uh, with, the, with the induction. So what's cool about this one is that it has an air fry, okay? Now this is the price and uh, because of the induction and some other stuff so i decided not to do that what i like about it also is it is a frigidaire gallery oh you can see my shoes and we have a frigidaire gallery um microwave okay so right now isabella is getting into the ovens let's go and have a look oh this is a samsung this is exactly oh but it's a double i don't want the double so we need to find the one which is not double because this is Hold on, so LG we don't want. Let's go on the other side. I'm pretty sure we saw it. So, oh, this is the, so that, that's what we are right now kind of trying to decide. So this one is another Frigidaire Gallery. It is with uh, air fryer. It does not have a tray, you need to order it. I think Isabella wants a blue one, but I do not want LG, so that doesn't go. So anyhow, so this one, again, it fits with our microwave. It looks good. It has the air fry option, which I really like, but it does not come with the tray. Now, if you look, uh, if you look here, it has knobs. So the cleaning, well, you can take it off, but you need to, you need to clean it, you know, guys. So what I like also, let's see, it has convex baking. Uh, it has the probe, which is cool. Well, the, the important stuff is the air fry. So this is the price. So kind of we're deciding between this and right now let's try to find the Samsung I am very liking. And I don't, that's Whirlpool. I don't see the Samsung here. Okay, you guys, so let me go around and try to find it and I'll okay, show you guys. So I'll just show you because they don't have it on a display and I saw it online. So I'll show you online later the picture, but this is what I like about it. So it has an air fryer, this one doesn't. So I'm just showing you the, the top from uh, another Samsung, but this is not the one. But what I like about it is it has the connected griddle. So you can put, sorry, you can put a griddle uh, and uh, it comes with it. And then another thing is it comes with the air fryer option. And again, the air fryer uh, tray is included. So I really, really like that. Now, another thing which it has, it has a Wi-Fi. So I'm going to, I'm going to look for the picture and show you. And obviously I'm going to show you later on guys when we actually, um, when we actually get it home. So yes, Missy. Okay. So let's find out if we can get it. It's, I don't think it's blue inside, but because we, I saw it yesterday at, uh, at Home Depot, but, and I was pretty sure I saw it here, but, well, I guess I didn't. Okay, so let's find out if we can get it delivered. Good morning, good morning, Jean. Dobry, welcome to Saturday. And Saturday in Polish is Sobota. So it is Sobota. We're going to be going racing uh, later on. Uh, I don't think I'll be showing you again unless something interesting, but what I wanted to show you, look at this. Ta-da! Can you see, can you see? It's new. Let me put the lights on. Can you see? Well, it's a little bit smudgy because I was trying to clean it right now, but it is, uh, you see it has a connected, connected. Yeah, hi. Yeah, hi. So what's cool about it? Let me let me go around. So I'm showing you all the ones in the in the store. So I'll show you here right now what I love about it. Air fry, keep warm and bread proof. Yes, I didn't try the all it was probably next vlog, but that's what it is. And here it's the connected two connected heaters. So you can put those together and then it came with uh, griddle. I already put my stuff here, but the griddle which goes on it so you can make eggs, you can make pancakes. So I'll definitely share it with you when I'm using it. So we went for Samsung and it looks so cool. I It looks worse here than it does on the... But yeah, I was cleaning it yesterday. I spilled some oil and I don't think I did a good job, but that's what it is. And it is connected to, uh, to uh, Wi-Fi. So I can tell uh, my Miss A that uh, I want her to preheat my um, my oven. And now I will also show you uh, breakfast. This is for Sebastian, only salt. This is for Isabella, I'll put regular 
the mayo. This is a disaster after making breakfast. And this is mine with low carb bread and the hot mayo. This one, I really, really like it. You guys got it at Costco. It's delicious. And this is for Catalina with some, some cheesecake. So that's it, guys. I think for this vlog, that's going to be enough. Uh, if I'm adding uh, some, I will probably won't be talking, but maybe I'll show the kids uh, with some nice music if we go, when we eat, if I go back to you, because I don't know if it starts raining, I will not go racing with them. And I really like it. So uh, can I just try to kind of make it not that greasy, you guys? And uh, so for the, oh, I didn't show you the, um, the air fryer um, insert. Hold on a second. Yeah, is it any better? No, it's just... It doesn't look like this bad, but when I look at the camera, it looks so smudgy. It's not that smudgy. Anywho. Okay, so uh, this is the, the tray here, what goes inside. And uh, it's nice to have a nice uh, cookie tray under, but the cookie tray, under, which I have, are too small. So I ordered some on Amazon and they're coming tomorrow. And then I uh, also ordered, not ordered, we went to Sobis right now and I bought a, a wider aluminum foil just to be able to line it. And uh, so probably in the next vlog, I'll share with you when I'm, when I'm using this. So anywho, I think uh, that's so cool. Yeah, my new. My new, oh, I, <laughs> I'm trying to figure out if that's going to be a nice, um, uh, how is it called? Nice thumbnail, you guys. I think it's going to be. Anywho, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. I'll share with you uh, my uh, opinion about the, the, the range we bought and whatever re recipes I will be working out with it, of course. And that's it for today. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you in my next video.